I jumped on it. And, you know, with his guidance, I got the right type of equipment. Uh, I had a lot of learning experiences. I'm still going through it because, you know, radio is not the same as it was when, you know, I was younger and doing it. And then being out of it for a few years or about 10 years, I mean, things have changed. And it was just like the first time I got behind the microphone, I really freaked out. I, I, I hit that button to open up the mic and I was sweating bullets. But getting to it, you know, I remember the first month I had five listeners and I was really depressed. And I called up Art Bell and I said, Art, nobody's listening to my show. I only have like five listeners. He said, don't worry about it. They'll come. They'll come. Well, the second month I was getting up to, I was still sweating bullets. I had like 15 listeners uh, with all the different apps we're on. And then it just really started going from 15 to hundreds to thousands to tens of thousands. And, you know, I try to give a paranormal show the way it should be. Like I have the guests just sitting, you know, in my room and we're just BSing and talking. You know, I don't want to hype it up and I don't want a guest on here that uh, isn't who they claim they are. I, I try to investigate the guests the best I can before I bring them on. And I just take it as we're talking as friends. And that's how I conduct my show. Well, anyway, we'll be back tomorrow. And again, I still say it's a bad idea of the scientists saying that, well, we should nuke uh, well, the, the ice caps on, on Mars. And that's going to create all these lakes and rivers. I, I do believe, after doing all the re- reading about the thin atmosphere, which is really thin, that uh, the other group of scientists saying that the, uh, well, the, the water would evaporate uh, really fast. It would be nothing there to hold it. And you know what? They're probably right. And then again, if you nuke something, isn't it going to be full of radiation? So, I mean, if you're you're trying to reestablish a planet back again, I don't think nuking the ice fields or the polar caps is the way to do it. But maybe, maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just a layman. Anybody, anyway, I should say, you guys all have a good evening. We'll be back tomorrow. If you would like to hear Night Dreams Talk Radio on your local radio station, let them know. Tell them to check out www.nightdreamstalkradio.com and thank you.